Welcome to The Appliance Show, Jonathan The Appliance Dude, coming at you from Curtis here in Westchester County. Today I am seated in full lotus position as I pontificate and meditate upon our newest arrival over here. Ladies and gentlemen, I want you to give a warm welcome to the dragon. Yes, this is the fire-breathing volcanic blue star R&B series, 36 inch range. Let's do it. Um, it's been, you know, I, I thought about bringing this product on for quite some time. I wasn't absolutely sold about the whole open burner thing, but as I saw the capital culinarian sales continue to, to rise, and even um, I've had some people asking about the VGI series with the Viking, and I said this open burner thing is going from just a niche to actually a viable product category, and it's a very passionate, passionate, fervent product category with a lot of banter about it. You know, when you look at this range here, this is actually the uh, ruby red color. So we have a red um, uh, door, red knobs. Actually, it's dressed in red on the sides as well. You look at this and it's definitely got that factor to it. You know, it's just absolutely just purrs. And um, um, the thing about this range that truly sells it, that sells itself to me, is that this is, this shares a direct lineage to the Garland range. And if you don't know what the Garland range is, Garland has a very, very storied history. Um, Garland has been making uh, commercial ranges for restaurants, et cetera, for decades upon decades upon decades. And they actually, for a brief period in the 90s, from about 89 to 99 or 2000, they actually had a product, um, a commercial range with a salamander above it, which was available for residential use. My mother actually has one. And I can tell you since the late 80s, when she bought this thing and has had not had one service call on it, most people who own Garland ranges will tell you that they are absolutely bulletproof. Um, they're just made like they're made like tanks. And um, uh, don't mean to come at you with all these martial analogies, but the fact of the matter is the thing is just I mean, it's, they're like indestructible. They stopped making them though. There are every so often I have somebody calling up saying, "How do I get my hands on a garland?" Da, da da da. And now we have some folks who are trying to replace those garlands from yesteryear. And this, my friends, is actually the range which is the closest approximation of it currently available for residential use. The reason, a couple of reasons why. First of all. It does truly share a history with Garland because it's actually being made in the same factory in Reading, Pennsylvania that Garland was manufactured in, okay? And the top, the storied range top on the Blue Star is, is literally, it is the Garland top, uh, for better or for worse. And we'll actually strike the for worse. There is no for worse with it. Uh, 22,000 BTU, 22,000 BTUs in the front. They're actually customizable. The whole top is customizable. You can move the burners all around. Um, simmer in the front, big, you know, big fat daddies in the back. Um, very highly customizable, customizable colors, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So there's a lot that you can do with this range. Um, it just has a, a very, very strong presence. People are walking in. And yes, I'm sure the color has something to do with it, but we also have another one here that's stainless and people are just kind of like, whoa, you know, it just kind of, it has a very commanding presence to say the least. This is probably another type of range that somebody's going to buy who doesn't cook. It's not cocktail party conversation. It's just simply, hey, you know, it's not really brand awareness. It's not, uh, you know, I'm a logo wearing this, that, whatever. This is about, I am a cook. I love cooking. I need a complete animal in my kitchen. I'm rolling with the Blue Star, okay? It's the same audience that's going with the Capital Culinarian. The construction on it is very, very nice. Um, it's not tinny sounding. You have your light here, your convection fan. Um, it's side ported, actually top and side ported doors. It has the, we love these, right? Your Varaglide rack, your Flexi rack, whatever you want to call it. I like to call it just a you know, fully extensible ball bearing rack. It's durable. You could actually buy more of these if uh, you want to put them into the upper and middle. Uh, they're, they're a pretty penny though, so be careful of that. You can fit a full catering tray in here. Yes, it is convection. It's five and a half cubic feet of capacity. My only gripe with this range actually is the oven door. I don't like the way this sounds, okay? I don't like that. Um, it rattles too much. I actually spoke to them and they're doing something about it. 